This election has featured record turnout and an impassioned electorate. And tonight, people are rallying in New York and other cities nationwide. CBS's Mola Lenghi joins us now. And good evening, Mola. Well, good evening, Nora. There are about 1,000 people here at this Manhattan park having taken to the streets earlier this afternoon, demanding that every vote counts. Now, these folks marched about 30 to 40 blocks through Manhattan, finally arriving here at Washington Square Park. Organizers are calling it a protect the vote, protect the results rally, saying they want to keep the pressure on and make sure that ballot counting in this presidential election is not stopped prematurely in some of the closely contested states that remain. We've seen pro-Joe Biden signs and T-shirts. We've heard anti-Donald Trump uh, chants out here. This is a mostly Joe Biden supporting crowd. Some protesters are accusing President Trump of trying to steal this election. Now, this is just one of a dozen similar rallies happening across the country from Philadelphia to Chicago to Washington, D.C., where there are about 100 protesters gathered. Uh, protesters have been largely peaceful out here, but of course there are dozens of NYPD police officers uh, who are out here and who in fact flanked the uh, crowds as they marched down here to the park and they say they are ready, not just tonight, but they will be for the next few days keeping an eye and monitoring any potential unrest in the aftermath of this election, Nora. All right, Mola Lange, thank you so much.